Okay, hello guys and uh, welcome. Um, the end of the road to PS5 is finally here in the UK. We have finally had the PS5. So as you can notice, it's not here right now. Um, it is a beefy boy. Um, so <laughs> it's like if I put when I put it up, it'll pretty much cover um, behind me. And I've spent ages putting out my PS1, my PS2, my PS3, and my PS4. You can see some accessories behind me as well. Hey Gaming Flea, um, welcome back. Just to let you know, there is about a 30 to 40 second delay um, on the stream and stuff, so just to let you know. Um, Johnny is in the chat room um, to keep an eye on things and he'll be posting some links as well for you guys as we go along. You'll notice me looking to the left quite a lot or to your right um, and that is because I'll be looking at the chat now and then. Feel free to ask any questions. Um, we are going to learn all this together, but I do have a little bit more knowledge um, on certain things um, than just winging it. So we shall do our best. Um, so, <laughs> how is everyone? I'm quite excited um, about this. Um, it's, I've been setting up this, uh, this setup for a while now. If there are any audio issues or um, any lag and things like that, do let me know. If I'm unclear with anything as well, then again, do let me know and um, I shall try and sort it out. Um, Johnny, um, you're in the chat room right now. How is everything sounding and looking before I bring the PlayStation up? So whilst I'm waiting for him to respond to me, I'm just gonna let you know that I have bought the digital edition of the PS5. Um, so it is um, discless. Um, I have seen online that some people have been having the disc version inside the digital box, but um, yeah, you got all the PlayStation's cool. Yes, I do, Game and Flea. Um, I did actually buy the PS2 just for this. I picked it up for £10 off eBay. I'm not too sure whether it works. I have put it on, but all the other ones are mine. I did have a PS2, but I sold it probably about 10 years ago, and I wish I didn't know for <laughs> reasons like this. I was going to have the games up and everything, but yeah, they're all there. And it, it looks pretty cool, doesn't it? And look at my little halo. i got a little halo behind me. Hey Rahim, um, well gel, sorry buddy, um, <laughs> um, yeah so uh, apologies to anyone who has managed to get one, Johnny has just managed to get um, a PS5 um, and apparently it will be delivered tomorrow um, and he's ordered it today, um, Amazon are now sold out, they were sold out within 20 minutes I believe. Um, but yeah, guys, can you hear me? Can you let me know um, if um, everything is going? Because it doesn't seem to be Johnny's responding to me. I just want to know that you can see everything okay. Um, the stream is doing well and the audio is okay before I bring this up. It's like I can hear myself um, fine, but um, I just want to make sure you guys um, can hear me before I bring up this bad boy. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so... Um, which one of you lot have um, got it out there as well? Um, did you order it? Um, have you been able to order it? Just let me know, really. Um, 
So we're going to, I'll talk you through what we're going to do today. We're going to bring up the PS5 and we're going to have a look at the box. Um, can hear you perfect. Thank you very much, uh, Game in Fleet. Um, so we're going to have a look at everything that's in the box. Um, I've already taken it out of the delivery box. It comes in um, a, a cardboard delivery box. So I've taken it out of that. Uh, so I've just got it next to me now. Um, we're going to open it up, see what's in the box, and then we're going to um, go ahead then with setting it up. Uh, so I've got this TV behind me. It's not 4K TV. Um, this is one of my old TVs. I do have a brand new TV um, for the PS5. But just for this, uh, we got that. Um, also, um, uh, what we'll do then is I'll chuck um, the secondary camera up on the TV uh, so you can see everything that's going on while I figure out how to do the sharing and we'll share that on the gaming channel. Um, first note is like um, on our PS uh, Road to PS5 videos, uh, we do say that we think that the uh, PSVR adapter is going to be in uh, the box, but it's not. You have to order it. It's free to order and free to deliver as well. You just need the serial number that's on the back of your VR box um, and then just um, send that off. Mine arrived today, um, literally about 30 minutes before the PS5, which was quite freaky. Um, but yeah, that's arrived today. Um, so I'll show you that later once we go have a little look at some of those accessories as well. Excuse me a second, my um, audio cable is pulling on me. There we go. All right. So without further ado, let's bring up the PS5. Oh, good God. Dum, dum, dum. So this is the PS5. Oh, digital edition. It's got a nice sexy black box for it. Try not to get the shine on there. So as you can see, it is huge. I've got quite a load down the seat as well, which doesn't help. Um, so um, Johnny says, I did manage, was shocked when Amazon sold out that I managed to get one. Um, so yeah, um, Johnny just put up um, another question on there as well. Um, that was lucky. Uh, my VR adapter will probably arrive uh, well after tomorrow. It did take me about um, a week and a half um, to get the, the uh, VR adapter. Um, it is giant, isn't it? Look at it. And the thing is, the cardboard box that it came in is pretty much the same size. But look at how sexy this is. So I usually usually keep the boxes for a while um, when I've got the PlayStations and stuff. But where am I going to keep this box? It's huge. But um, yeah, so let's have a look at um, what's on the um, front. So it's literally just um, got the PS5, uh, PS5 Digital Edition, 8K, 4K, 120 HDR discless free console um so discless free console disc free console that's what it says um also got the um playstation plus thing down there disc free console internet connection and account for playstation network required it's got 8k 4k 120 hertz and hdr content require a compatible display and supporting software um so yes brilliant um Right, and on the side, it's just got uh, PS5. It's got the content. So inside, it's got the PlayStation 5 digital um, console, wireless controller, base, HDMI cable, AC power cord, USB cable, printed materials, and Astro's Playroom pre-installed game. Um, so yeah, we haven't got a disc because it's a digital version. And on this side, then, oh, so you got. Um, beautiful image oh, there we go. Um, of uh, what it looks like and the controller and then on the back we do have um, quite a bit more information um, there I'm just gonna change uh, cameras here to see, uh, see if you could see that a little bit better and I can read it a bit better for you as well then so lightning speed harness the power of a custom CPU and SSD with integrated IO um, that rewrite the uh, rules of what a PlayStation console can do Breathtaking immersion. Discover a deep, um, a deeper gaming experience with support for haptic feedback, ha adaptive triggers, and 3D audio technology. Now I can't wait uh, to sample all that. To be honest, and then stunning games. Um, Mar Mar <laughs> it was like Marvel. What? Um, Marvel and incredible graphics and experience. Um, new PS5 features. Play a back catalog of supported PS4 digital games with system update. Um, and it's got lots of. Um, right down underneath there as well, which I'm not going to go through. So, um, right, we're going to go now. And hey, Rebecca, um, it's huge. It is huge, yeah. So we're going to go ahead now and open uh, the box up. Um, I'm going to have a little look 
at um, which camera is better uh, to open it up whether um, the second cam is I'll try and lay it out there or whether we'll flip back to this one just let me know which you think is is better is it possible to check um, if the 3d works from your headset um, from the PS4 um, the 3D works uh, with your, oh, the 3D Pulse headset. Yes, it is uh, compatible. Um, um, I will talk about them in a moment. Um, so here they are, the uh, 3D Pulse headsets. They are so comfy. Um, I have had a, um, a voice chat. I've used it with a uh, DualShock 4 controller on the PS4. Um, you have um, a little uh, jack cable you can pop into um, one of the PS4 controllers, the DualShock 4s, and it's brilliant. Only thing is, um, after a while, it did cut out, so I'm not too sure why that was. Um, but it's probably because it's not designed for the P uh, DualShock 4. But you use that jack to put it into uh, the VR headset. So I will try that. I'm not going to do any VR headset stuff today. I am going to do a video though for you, showing you how to set up the VR on the PS5, so just watch that. Right, okay, let's, um, without further ado, let's um, get into this. Let's flip over to um, the two cams. I'm doing pretty well. I haven't hit the mood button yet. That's probably because I've remapped the button. <laughs> it's no longer M on my on my pad. <laughs> right, okay. As you can see, it's quite thick as well. There's my hand. <laughs> it's like, what? Right, okay. Oh no, I don't want to damage the box. Where we go? I do have a little tool here, but I want to be able to reseal this. Right. Oh, it's like Christmas, everyone, isn't it? Here we go. Let's... I'm going to keep that there and I'm just going to pull it on the inside there. <laughs> right. Okay. Try not to dust on this. <laughs> it's been sitting in a warehouse for ages. Oh. Right. I just try not to break the box at all, really. Ah, there we go. So those boxes I always tend to slightly rip um, the sides and stuff. Good God, this is huge! <laughs> right, okay. Let me pull this one first. Okay. Uh, Johnny, there is. Oh, you've already done it. Uh, I was about to say, um, <laughs> can Johnny pop up the link for to get the PSVR camera? Adapter, but he's already done it, so that's good. Oh, there's two ways up. That's it. Um, okay. It actually gives you instructions on how to open it, too. <laughs> oh, right, okay. This is where everything falls out and breaks, and I'll be like, no. Thank you very much, Johnny. All right, okay. Oh, all right. So that's one box there. Oh, here it is. Here it comes. Here it is. Oh, God. It is heavy, guys. It is heavy. All right, and that's it for that box. <laughs> all right. Also, it's not polystyrene, which is good. It's a recyclable cardboard. Um, so that is always good. Let's pop those in there. Back in the box. Out of the way. It's like I'll go through the accessories and things in a moment. Let's just have a look at this. This machine that we've been waiting so long for. I am <laughs> it's mind-boggling. It's like if you look behind it's like I'll do this in a moment. But if you look behind me at the different size of the consoles and stuff. We'll have a chat about that in a moment. Let's just get this out and have a look. Oh my god, guys, look at that. Oh, wow. Oh, I like that. Alright, let's just flip that back to one camera. Oh my god, it looks even better on camera. <laughs> but no, it, oh, it is stunning. It's like, <laughs> it's a little bit bigger than... Um, your box files you take to school and things. I can remember those days. Um, but no, look at that. 
Whoa, I love it. I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. Loving it like that. Okay. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, so that's, that's like um, cut out uh, the PS logo in the top. All right. Okay, so you can take these panels off, but I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to look into that. Um, I, there is a video from PlayStation to show you how to do that. Um, so you've got um, a USB-C port there and a USB-3 port, I do believe that one is. And the power button is there. It's a push button, which is a little strange. I thought it was going to be in more of a, like a touch uh, button. And then on the back, um, we have... Let's have a look. Uh, so we've got two um, USB-3 ports there and HDMI LAN and the power there. Oh, what's that up top? Who knows? Who knows what that bit is? But there we go, guys. There's the um, the digital edition. Um, so you've got the Sony logo on the inside as well, which is engraved in there. And um, yeah, oh, I can't wait for this. I, I prefer Xbox. I Yeah, you would, Raheem. You would. <laughs> but it's big. Everyone's saying it is big. But there we go. Let's pop that there and we're gonna go back now to um this excuse um my bookcase over there with the first aid kit and the heater as well um obviously in a um attic room which is the studio um <laughs> it gets quite cold up here so oh no what's happened to there little folio over the box right so got a quick start guide and we have a safety guide um got the guarantee as well on there um so you've got um the dual sense controller and it's like i've i've got um, the dual sense behind me as well um and it feels so nice it is quite heavy um it's the heaviest uh, controller out of all four controllers um but oh, that feels nice it's got um uh, rough edges around uh, the uh, the joysticks as well, so you can you're not like slipping off all the time on there. The um, PlayStation button on there, can you just see that there? Instead of a, a round button, it's actually a custom shape, which is great. Um, that is a mute. You can mute the microphone because there is a mic there, and that is your charging port. This glows a lovely color on there. So that is uh, your create button. Um, which replaces share. I do believe it's just exactly the same, and that's your options. And then look at all that, that's nice. And then the um, adaptive triggers and a USB-C port on the back and the charging port um, underneath. And it's like, if I just bring this back now, if you can look over my shoulder, I've already got the docking station and that is just resting on there. It says to click it in, but you just pop it on and it goes in anyway. So I will charge that one up. This one is fully charged, so we're going to use that one later. So I'm just going to pop this back in here. Uh, I can't wait to have all the different features on it, the adaptive um, triggers, the haptic feedback. I really can't wait for any of that, really. Oh, so in here then you have your USB-C, um, which will go with the um, controller. So you have to put it, pop it into the front of uh, the PlayStation first to uh, um, sign it up to that. Uh, got the power cable. All right. Um, have you noticed uh, the pattern on the grip of the pad? Uh, let's have a look. Um, on the pattern on the grip. Which pattern are you on about down there? The, um, gaming flea i shall leave it out uh, so when you um, reply then i shall leave it all out uh, why not so what's in here then um let's have a look oh that's the base um for it um a lot of people do not like the base um you don't have to have the base but i will um, set it up once um i've taken it down the stairs um so that is i think it's quite a nice little base there and it'll help um keep it cool and stuff so i will use my user guide um, on how to set that up and set it up i'm not going to do a um 
XO. Let's have a look. Mm -hmm. I don't see any XO on there. Hmm. Okay. Right. Um. Yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm not going to do a video on how to to how to put that uh, the stand onto the con console, but there are videos out there. So just have a look on YouTube. Um, I think there's actually an official PlayStation one um, that helps you do it. Whoa, that's actually a decent quality HDMI cable. Wow. Shocked by that. Usually they're quite cheap, but that, that seems quite sturdy there. Um, I do have a nice one already um, for that. But that is literally, that's the contents of the box there, guys. So, wow. <laughs> okay. Um, so, it's, uh, yeah. oh, we're already back on this one anyway. So, um yeah, so that's all the accessories. So let me just lay these out um, just to show you guys what is going to be on in the box. Um, just have a little look. It's got these here, 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 and then the base. There, so there we go. So you can see everything there. Um, uh, 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 it's pretty small. You might need a magnifying glass. Ah, okay, right. Um, he got me like, where is it? I shall find it. The light in here isn't brilliant. And obviously I've got a light shining straight in my eyes. And I've got two lights going on the background for this. But I will have a look. And um, next time we chat, we shall let you know whether I saw it or not. My eyesight isn't the best either. It's like I've got glasses. Um, everything is magnified by this. So I can actually see it. But there we go. Right, cool. Well, that is everything. So what I was going to say um, earlier is, um, let's just pop that back there. It is interesting to see how big this is. And I was just talking to someone the other day and I was thinking, the PS3 is huge, it's quite big, but I knew the PS5 was gonna be bigger. So I'm just wondering how bigger it is. So let's uh, just bring this across. Now this is a lot heavier than that, <laughs> for sure. But here we go, look at the size difference on those <laughs> so it's a lot taller um, width wise let's have a little look so it's about the same really yeah maybe the PS5 is a little bit bigger than the PS3 um, width wise um, or thickness really um, it's like widthwise that way, um, it's the PS3 is the thing. So it's almost fully bigger in all dimensions. Fully bigger, that's my word of the day. So there we go. All right, let's pop that back there. Okay, so guys, yeah, that is um, the unboxing. Um, Zen, hello, bro, that console is bigger than my future. <laughs> <laughs> Your future is bright, Zen. <laughs> there you go. Um, it is huge. Um, and it feels like a box file. <laughs> um, I love the the fact that they've gone for like a taco design on pretty much everything that they have. Um, this time, I don't know why. Can't wait for uh, replaceable um, panels. Um, I know that uh, PlayStation have uh, stopped uh, certain... Uh, retailers from selling uh, cheap ones uh, so we shall see what PlayStation come up with and how much they're gonna cost so what we're gonna do now um, I will bring uh, the accessories over just a second uh, just I have a quick little chat about them so like I said I've already um, used these um, as a um, uh, as a, um, a chatting thing with, on the PS4 as a chatting headset and they are so comfy, the noise uh, cancelling reduction on it and everything. What comes in the box with this is a HDMI, um, no sorry, not a HDMI, a USB-C cable for charging. Um, it doesn't come with a plug, uh, you just have to plug that into the console. Um, and what else does it come with? It comes with a um, jack to jack, uh, mini jack to mini jack. So you can pop it into your phone to use as um, as um, headphones for your phone. 
Um, you can't use Bluetooth with a Bluetooth on your phone because it has got an adapter, um, a USB adapter uh, for the wireless connection. But you can use that on your television, on your laptop, anything else. Um, so it does work with that. I can't wait um, to, uh, to experience uh, it fully. Um, noise cancelling is amazing. It's like, um, it is so crystal clear. I was um, playing Uncharted 2 uh, with these headphones on and um, even though that game isn't uh, 3D uh, sound, I could hear that it, um, somebody was knocking there. Not somebody was knocking on the, my right hand side. Somebody was knocking there. Uh, so yeah, I can't wait to listen properly. Uh, to that. I've also got the um, USB uh, controller here as well so we're going to set this up in a moment um, to this TV um, and the PlayStation 5 um, and we'll test out the little hotkeys and everything on there as well and also I've got the uh, bobsled uh, or the tackle which is the charging station and uh, it does come with a plug um, so it goes in there and it's quite nice because it um, it's like a L shape uh, which plugs in there so you don't have an Odd sticking out um, of the back uh, or anything like that and it is like I said it is quite um, nice to slot them in um, just goes straight in touches down and Bob's your uncle but there we go that is all that so what we're gonna do now guys is I am going to um, reposition some of the cameras and things we're gonna uh, pop on the TV and then we're gonna hook it up then so I'm gonna take you through everything from hooking it up to actually uh, going through the menu and the setup and things like that. I will be uh, stopping the screen uh, when I'll be putting in my passwords and things like that, obviously, um, but we're gonna go through everything together. So I'm just gonna mute myself and pop on the welcome coming back um, screen, um, but we will be as quick as we can because I've gotta move this table and everything and move all the uh, cameras and sound, but uh, we'll be back in a moment, okay? Thank you very much.
Okay. Um, okay, so we are back. I've um, just repositioned myself a little bit. So let's uh, just alter this camera a second. There we go. Um, okay, so uh, we are back, guys. Um, just let me know if there are any changes in sound and things like that. Hello, Victoria. Hello, uh, Rudy Taker. Welcome and thanks for joining us. Um, Rudy Taker says, I'm playing Godfall, Miles Morales and Destiny 2 Beyond Light. Everything loads so quickly and looks so pristine. I'm in awe. Well, hopefully I can sort that out today. Um, <laughs> this isn't as pretty my background as I did have earlier. But um, what we're going to do, first of all, I'm just going to jump over there. So this is going to be um, just nothingness. Um, and we're going to go through plugging up everything and then we're going to go ahead and switch on the TV. So let's go over to this cam. There we go. Oh, that looks pretty decent. Um, so I'm going to have to try and talk a little bit louder, I think, for this one. But um, I'm just going to go over there a second. All right. Okay, guys. Um, let me just turn around so I can see there we go all right okay so as you can see on the back part of this i've already plugged in the power cable uh, because i didn't want to be doing that um, and then just shoving it in uh, okay so first i'm going to pop in the hd camera oh that's um something i didn't say as well um, on top of the tv i do have the hd camera so we shall have a look at how that looks later but um Let's just pop this in here. It's not going to be any neat and tidy. I'm just going to plug them in. Um, so I can see when I'm plugging things in. Oh, that's quite tight. There we go. And then we'll um, take the sheet off that. And then we shall pop that in there. Simple, easy does it. So let's turn that around. Go. So that is now in place. I'm um, just going to quickly show you um, whilst I'm here. So this is um, the box. Um, let me just move this a second. So this is the box that it came in, little packet, um, and it just comes with uh, the adapter and the uh, just a little guide on how to do it. Um, so. This is for the PS4 camera to be able to work with the PS5. So you've got a USB 3 um, there. And then you also got the socket then for the PS4 camera on the back. Um, which is quite interesting. It goes quite far in really. Um, it's got the PlayStation logo there. And there we go. So that is that. I will do a video, like I said, on that another time. But let's go back to the PS5. Right. Okay. And we're going to turn the TV on first. Right. I'm just noticing now the TV is stinking. Oh, well. Okay, so TV is coming on. Sometime today. Two seconds, guys. The TV is not switching on. Here we go. Right. There we go. Much better. <laughs> Right, okay, so I do believe I have it in HDMI 1, so we're going to switch that over first. Oh, no, HDMI 3, apparently. Switch my wife. Uh, let's just do that. Okay, and we're going to hit the power button. And then move this over here. Okay, 
so it is loading up. Hello, I'm back. <laughs> Alright. Let's try and bring this back a little here. Is it this screen? It is. Right, so it's not... Um, sorry guys, just uh, trying to sort out the cameras and things first. Okay, um, yeah, I think this will do for just this test, I think. All right, then. It's still on HDMI 3, apparently. So I switched to HDMI 1. Well, there we go. <laughs> Okay, I will. So we're going to um, unravel now, um, if I unravel it the right way, the USB-C cable. And we're just going to plug that in. To the front. <laughs> And you just slot that in there. Okay, so done that. And then we have to press the PS button. Select your language. English, United Kingdom. Yep, that's my language. Make sure we can see everything on this camera. Yes, we can. Alright. I can turn down this brightness. There we go. So that should be a bit better. And if I turn this light off as well. There we go. It's a bit better, isn't it? There we go. Um, continue with the screen reader turned on. Nope, I just want to turn it off. Um, that is not the HDMI cable that came with it, uh, Game in Flea. Uh, this is the um, is, is one I have. Um, I did show you um, that one is a black one, but it's got quite thick, bulky um, connectors, which looks pretty decent quality. So they, I'm just running it with, with um, one of the high-end ones that I have now. Um, so we go with this. This is my internet. Um, so I'm just going to switch over now to... Um, just to this camera a second while I pop in my key and then I shall pop it back for you guys then in a moment okay I did have a um, keyboard I was gonna pop in um, here we go, right, L2, that's what I need, okay, so, okay, there we go, so I'm just gonna pop this back over for you guys to see now as well. You can see my lovely setup behind me as well, can't you? <laughs> but there you go. Right, okay, done. Okay, connecting to a Wi Fi. Okay. Um, I did do a test on my Wi Fi as well, guys, and um, the Wi Fi is a little low today. I don't know why. Yesterday it was far better, uh, but today it's very low, and I don't know why. There we go. All right. Any questions, guys, uh, just pop them down. Um, I will answer them as um, 
as honestly and factually correct can't connect to the internet. Okay. Failed. Okay. Alright, okay, so I'm going to try it one more time. Um, connecting to the internet. It could be because I am in the highest point of the house um, and the Wi-Fi isn't... Oh, there we go. It's done it now. Uh, so there you go. So the circles um, should fill the screen without showing black borders. Um, if the circles are cut off or if you see black borders, press up and down to adjust it. So let's go up and down first. So there we go. Look, so uh, you want to put it to the screen size, which is that for this screen. And I will be changing this... Um, when I put it onto a different screen anyway, so, okay. Um, power options for rest mode. Uh, so control the amount of power consumed and the features your PS5 can use while in rest mode. So low power use consumes less power uh, with some features disabled. Does, um, doesn't apply updates. They'll download and install when the console is on. Uh, doesn't charge controllers, right, okay. Um, or optimize experience. Always applies the latest updates. Make sure you save your game as it could close during an update. Turns on remotely when you connect using PlayStation app or remote play. Um, charges controllers after entering rest mode. Consumes more power or custom. So we're going to go with optimized experience because um, it'll just be like the PS4 then. Um, I do tend to knock off my PlayStations more than put them in rest mode anyway. But if you are downloading something, then it is um, it's beneficial when you just pop it on rest mode so it's on a lower power consumption. Um, so you've got all the um, uh, agreements there. Of course, we're not going to read them. We do read them. Yes, we do. I agree. Um, oh, circles. <laughs> all right. Okay. So when I can, I am going to make this screen. Um, I'm going to share the screen on hopefully the gaming channel. Um, so then you can see uh, it in a better quality than just chucking a webcam onto the screen at the moment. So any other questions you've got, guys, um, just let us know. Um, if you would like to support us in any way um, there are many different ways you can just share our videos that really helps out a lot um, or um, user one well, let's change that it's not going to be user one it's going to be shack um, other ways you can uh, support us is by going to our coffee um, site which is coffee.com for slash skybot film and Johnny will be popping in the chat um, in a moment and um, the link to that and we've also got a patreon which we will be loading uh, which will be launching next year and I'll talk a little bit about that later ah, there you go um, <laughs> um, the gaming channel uh, sorry I forgot to, to mention the gaming channel but uh, Johnny has put it in the chat right now which is youtube.com for slash skybook gaming um, help us build the best PlayStation experience to improve um, our services and fix bugs. We were trained did, did to use. Yeah, that's fine. Um, I'm okay with them having my data to hopefully improve everything. Welcome to the PlayStation 5. Nice. Nice. Oh, it's Astro Boy. So there we go. That's already loaded up. So we might look into that in a moment. So, there we go, guys. It's... Um, it's all set up. So let's have a look at um, some other things. Let's go into settings. Um, I haven't obviously signed in, um, so we shall do that first. So let's go uh, to users and accounts. Uh, so we're gonna go sign in there. I should really plug in my, um, well, I should be able to unplug that now. And there we go, that's now free roaming there. Update the system software to use um, network things. So continue on that, it's looking for a system update. So hopefully it won't be too big. It's 868 and it's saying 99 plus hours left. We might have to cancel this, um, this thing now. There we go. 
We shall see what it does in um, a moment. If not, then I will try and cancel that. The next gen has arrived at Skybar. It has indeed. Providing I can get my software update done. I was just gonna grab the um, the keyboard a second. It is like a danger field right now around here. It was, so it is starting to download. Um, very slowly. Uh, so I do think the internet isn't the best at the moment up here. Probably because I'm streaming as well. Um, in the Welsh Valleys, we don't have a fantastic internet. So let's see if I can cancel this. Yes, I can. There we go. Um, so what else shall we do? Networks, um, using the accounts, screen and video. So this is all really cool. Um, let's come out of that. Place your store, you've got to have your network connection on there. Um, Astro Boy. So let's click on the um, on the create button now and see what that says. So you got to take a screenshot, start new recording, or save previous gameplay. All right, okay, capture options. Oh, does it mean we can't live stream? Hmm. Include your mic's um, audio, that's a yes. Include party audio, that'll be a yes. Video clip file type, most efficient. Uh, let's go Let's go with MP4, uh, that's better for me. Um, let's go with a PNG um, for this, the image. JPEG, there we go. All right, so it does seem like there is an issue with my internet, probably like I said, because I'm streaming. Um, how big is the update? Looks like it's under one gig. It is an 800 odd meg. Um, but I do believe because, like I said earlier, my internet is running a little slow today. Um, and the fact that I'm streaming, it um, isn't helping. But that is a little bit strange that there are no um, live streaming session on there. But that might be because I'm not uh, connected to the internet uh, just yet. Uh, so you've got game library there. Uh, maybe you need to be um, in a game to broadcast. Quite possibly, yeah. Um, so I'm going to um, uh, start. Can't record this content. Uh, there we go. So you can't record. Um, can you? Start and you can't record this content. Um, so you can take screenshots of your homepage, but you can't screen capture it. Uh, so you can't record as a video um, so we've got media um, okay so we are going to need to do um, the update to be able to do any more with that I can play a game um, and I'll have a look at that uh, to see what the first impressions are but everything is very smooth and quickly running and I can't hear the PS5 at all I can hear my fans of my PlayStation going but I can't hear the PS5 at all and look how beautiful it is looking all lit up and things as well you can't quite see it there because of the lighting but it is stunning all right okay so let's have a little look um, at settings um, we're gonna go back into network um, oh we're not we're gonna go um, to accessories now we're gonna grab my um, media remote. Um, so we're gonna go down to re media remote and set up media remote. Um, with the current system software version, you can set up the media remote uh, to control your PS5 only. Uh, so if you want to, con uh, if you update the system software to PS5, you can control. Uh, you can set up the media to control your TV. So let's just do control the PS5 at the moment. Uh, so looking for your remote, um, so I do have to press options and the PS button at the same time. Um, where's the options button? There it is, right. So hold those down. I do have batteries in there.
Okay, so it is flashing. So it is searching um, for it, but doesn't seem to be trying to. It's right here. It's right here. So it's good that I'm doing all this just to show you guys um, some of the frustrations that I might you might have. You need to have a good internet connection, and it needs to be able to uh, to run everything really on there. Um, couldn't quite see that on that camera. What about on this one um, here? There you go. See, so it's flashing on that one there. Not having much luck, are we, guys? The battery take and the battery, the remote takes two AA batteries, and they do actually come with the remote as well. Um, and they are Sony batteries, so they should be decent quality. Um, so um, just have a look at this a second. I might bring it on this camera here, to be honest. So look, so you got a little button that's underneath there, and you just push that in. And then the back comes off, and there's the um, the double A's in there. Then, and then you just slot that back on. Then, let's move that camera back into place. Okay, so it looks like. This isn't gonna work either, guys. I do apologize. Right, okay, so what I think we are gonna do, um, let me just uh, flip that uh, back to just me. There we go, we are here. Hi guys, Um. so I think I'm gonna call that stream quits uh, there. I'm going to run the updates and things like that, and then possibly then come and do another video uh, just to uh, to show you everything on there um, but if not then uh, just pop some comments down below asking ask me all your questions and I will answer them for you uh, obviously we like I said earlier we are doing this um, as as soon as it's happening so they might actually uh, have these technical issues like this um, and it also might happen with you guys as well so other people might and have it even easier to do but um, unfortunately for me it's not working out at the moment but I am planning on doing some uh, review videos on each of the uh, accessories and how easy it is to set up and things like that and I'll show you uh, different guides how to do that with the VR I'll show you how to order your free adapter and I'm going to show the difference in the PS4 camera and the PS5 camera as well uh, but we shall be doing that over the next few weeks uh, so keep me no, well, make sure you uh, click that subscribe button and the notification bell as well, just to keep up to date um, with everything. So um, Johnny has popped in our uh, on the chat but there that we are launching our Patreon next year. Uh, but it is live at the moment, but we haven't officially launched it. So if you do want to support us um, by uh, becoming a Patreon, um, then you can um, just... Uh, go on to the support tier and um, the rewards tiers are not available at the moment if you if you click on them you will be charged it but there aren't any rewards for them just yet so please don't do that um, because you won't be getting your money back unfortunately on that um, if you do click on the support one that is one dollar or one pounds um, or one euro um, it's one whatever your currency is and um, we can't adjust that it is just that um, and with that it will help us out because um, it's just showing your appreciation uh, for us or uh, like I said earlier you can go to our coffee um, website and uh, Johnny will pop that in the live chat as well um but i think that's it um yeah so uh johnny's just popped up uh, the thank you very much for watching uh the stream um if i can get this up and running today now um be brilliant i will do a live stream tonight i do want to play uh spider-man miles morales 
um, so I will do that. So we will be playing that on our gaming channel, which is Skybot Gaming on YouTube, not Twitch. We're on YouTube. Everything is on YouTube um, for our videos. So um, I think that's it. I'm just gonna babble a little bit more to see if Johnny has any other questions or whether any, he needs to say anything else. But I am a little bit gutted that this hasn't worked out the way I wanted it to work but I kind of had a feeling it would as well. So I'm just gonna uh, pack things up now and um, put the studio back together because as I moved everything around, everything um, was demolished pretty much. So I've got to put everything back. Thank you guys for popping along and um, sharing the excitement with me. Um, it's been a long road. Um, Without you, my friend. No, uh, it's been a long road uh, to the PS5, but it's finally here now and it looks stunning. I can barely hear it. All I can hear is that monstrosity in the corner. Um, but I can't wait to play some games. Um, goodbye, Gaming Flea. Goodbye to everyone um, who has watched. Um, thank you for chatting. Um, and we will look forward to seeing you guys again. So um, let me find my mouse um, so I can end this. Here we go. Right. Um, yes. Uh, so let's pop on. Uh, which screen? This screen. There we go. <laughs> but yeah, thanks again, guys. It's been a pleasure um, sharing this experience with you. And we hope to share many, many more experiences. And we do have lots planned on both this channel and the gaming channel. So, until next time.